Ooh. That's your fastest Quick. ball speed. Yep. We're done, folks. <laughs> Could you play that? Yeah, absolutely. I think the shape, it's definitely, it's definitely more compact than what TSR2 was. This is insane. Look at your carry. You walked in at 227, you're walking out at 241. I haven't really even done anything yet. Uh, I just I put the new head on, right? What's up, guys? Chris. Good to see you, buddy. Nice to see you. Glad really you. Good. good to see you. How's everything? Yeah, good. Excited. Excited for this. How was your fitting? We, we got there. We uh, we got to a place I didn't think, honestly, we could get. I think right at the end, we, we gained like eight miles in our ball speed on uh, on Gamer versus the, the GT3. Uh oh, I got some work to do then. Huh? Yeah, that, was, that, was a, that was a big, big jump. So yeah. yeah, I'm excited for what you can do with Mike. He's been driving it actually really, really good heard, this year. Yeah. So I think that's a, such a better place to do testing from is when, totally. you know, it's when it's really good. Whereas I'd been struggling a little bit, so I'm excited to see where you guys get to. Yeah, I know Titleist does a good job making it better, but this driver's been yeah special. It's been you really know, good. TSR is really good, right? Yeah. And so, all guys, this is my favorite driver ever. And it's like, well, we have to make it better. And I'm excited to show you GT. I know you got to watch a little bit of his, yeah. but get you hitting it and see what Love we can it. do for you. Very cool. Um, let's start with your driver. Okay. Let's kind of just get some baselines with yep. it. Yep. Nice. Kind of what you've been seeing out there? Yeah, Healy and I, you know, I tend to stay a little too far back. Okay. Um, so I can come out of it a bit. Yuck. Is that the big miss off the heel there? Yeah. Yeah. That happened a lot? Not much. Not much, okay. Not too much. Indoors, when we're doing driver testing, Chris, it, it pops in more, but on the golf course, he's, he's he can get cooking with those center to toe strikes. Mm. So Better there? Better strike, yeah. Okay, okay good. Blech. It's all right, let's talk for a sec. The numbers are pretty good. You know, they're not that far off. I mean, obviously, you know, you see a little bit of a spin variance here with yours. You know, your lows 21, your highs, you know, up in the 35s. Yeah. A lot of that's due to this, right? The attack and the path and, and the heel strike. Mm -hmm. The heel strike's mm -hmm. gonna add a bunch of spin. Um, but I mean, the average is solid. The, just like see that window, that 396 yeah, tighten yeah, yeah. up a little bit, right? Um, ball speed's a little bouncy too, yeah, yeah. right? That's always my first job is how do we get that ball speed to be really consistent? And that just comes from strike, mm -hmm. right? So we got to see if we can get something that potentially hits them more in the center. And I do think GT is going to help you a ton, totally. right? Okay. So I know you've already seen them because you got to sit the ends, but this yeah. is GT. I'm excited cool. to show it to you. I want you to hit all the models, yeah, let's right? Do it. First, um, what shape do you think you like the most? Yeah, I mean, you know, whatever it looks like, whatever TSR3, looks like what you've got. Yeah. Yeah. Old Faithful. I mean, that shape is really nice. What is this? <laughs> Shocker. That actually looks quite good. It's really similar too, right? Yeah, a little longer, yeah, you know, right front here. to back, but yeah, it sits nice. It sits a little higher off the ground. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Kind of easy to tell what that one is. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's... yeah I always found fours sat maybe a little shut in my opinion to me. Yeah. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, I love the shape. Yeah. Yeah, this this actually looks quite nice. I was, this is two I'm assuming. Yeah, that I like that, that's nice. Both three and two are really nice, but this this is clean, very clean. You like three more? Yeah, shape-wise, yeah, absolutely. How's it look, shape-wise? I mean, it sits so good. Similar, so right? So good, yeah, very, Frames very a little bit better with those bigger white lines, a little wider too. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. It's gonna be the killer. Way more consistent on right. ball speed, Chris, and just. And what I see already, look at the spin. Yeah, yeah. Both spin rates yeah. are 28, 28. Totally. You don't see that variance where he had a lot of yeah. bounce to that, it. That bottom four. Yeah. Probably were quite kind of somewhat similar in terms of strike. Yeah, for sure. Close there, right? Yeah. One more. Nice there. 
a little out of the heel too. You hear it, right? Yeah, but heel, the yeah. ball speed stayed the same. Yeah. It feels great. Good. Okay. The launch conditions wise, Mikey, like that's so really the consistent good. ball speed and the yeah. consistent spin, right? I think controls the north and the south. Yeah. Right? This is inconsistent ball speed and inconsistent spin. Yeah. You see your spin tighten up a ton, right? You know, JJ says it really well. But I'm trying to live with everything in the twos, yeah. right? Don't like ones, don't like threes. Yep. And with yours, you kind of had, you kind of were on both sides of it. Totally. Right? Yeah, um, that standard deviation of spin is, is getting tighter. Yeah. yeah. And then, like, a question I get all the time, you know, people always ask me, like, what perfect spin is on a driver. They ask fitters that all the time. Yeah. To answer that question, I need to know what your ball speed, your launch is, right? People say, Chris, what's perfect launch? Well, then to answer that question, you know what your spin, right? Yeah, and, yeah. If you just looked at land angle, it's such an easy, yeah. like, just because land angle is the combination of yeah. all those things. Yeah. It kind of tells you where you want to live. And 32 is a little low, yeah. the one you walked in with, right? And this one's closer to 35. Right. I like to see the high right one at least 40, 41. Agreed. That low left one stay above 30, mm -hmm. 32. And then you kind of have this nice, consistent distance. Yeah. I do want to have you hit the two next, though. Okay. Just want to see what a deeper CG would do for totally. your ball flight, right? Immediately right. tighter. Amazing that spin stayed at 21 when the dynamic went to 17.5. I mean, that's the furthest carry and your furthest total of the day. And yeah. honestly, I think you missed it. Yeah. I yeah. think you have more in that. Where'd you hit that? A little high? A little high, yeah. yeah. It felt. Like Closer to toe, though, that time. Okay. Was it? Yeah, okay. yeah. Ooh. That's your fastest Quick. ball speed. Yep. We're done, folks. <laughs> Could you play that? Yeah, absolutely. I think the shape, it's definitely, it's definitely more compact than what TSR2 was. I mean, I think, you know, anytime you start seeing CG creep towards the face, mm -hmm. right? Three, four, mm -hmm. then we start seeing that, yeah. right? You see the deepest CG? I mean, my, the first one was a miss at 42. That's at 49. But look at the spin. Yeah. This Face, is, yeah. This is insane. Look at your carry. You walked in at 227. You're walking out at 241. Yeah. Wow. I haven't really even done anything yet. No, I just I put the new head on, right? Easy as that. It's just all forward. I was going to say, just yeah, diving. Tumble. I don't hate that either. I mean, the ball speed's a bit down. down yeah. Hey, you could hit a four. Yeah, yeah. The launch conditions wise, you could, but the contribution of the ball speed's yeah. plummeted. Yeah, yeah. Lost a, a ton of speed. That two was just kind of getting the face to pass squared up. Yeah, two and started then, left. You know, obviously went right, whereas like that's that was nice to see it start yeah. a bit left. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you were the last one. The second one with the the uh, GT two was really one forty nine. Yeah. That uh, last one there is one. Just to have you hit it though, I want you to hit the four with the weight back and just okay. I want you to see this difference here. And then we'll go back to that too. Like, I, to me, it does feel stiffer. Yeah. When we're back, it goes Healy. I mean, the cool thing is, is like, yellow's the one you walked in with. Yeah. yeah. Right? Yeah. And then you got red and white, which is the two. Mm -hmm. So from a playability standpoint and a consistency standpoint, remember, I'm always looking at the north and the south. I feel yeah. like as a fitter, that's what I have control over the most. I think yeah, east yeah. and west is tough sometimes, that's right? That's uh, really good. But if I get point. your north and south really good, yeah. golf's hard. If you ever figure out east and west, you let me know how you did it. <laughs> The Healy, I mean, the Healy one starts a bit more left. It's like, in terms of lines and shapes, night and day. Yeah. And that's 2,600 out of the uh, heel. I know. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Center punch. Good. See, that's the one that's interesting because that's the better flight, yet the speed goes south. I get steeper on it? Yep. Yeah. One, four. Yikes. Yep. I love what you what you have done with the the, the silver lines either side. Yeah, like yeah. that's a, that's so smart. 
It's funny because like some of our tour players with TSR are having us paint. Yeah, yeah. Some thicker lines. Nice. Yeah. Just got to be careful. The, where did you strike that? A little low in the head? Yeah. 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 Just need to be careful not to lose the launch if you're going to drop the spin a little bit like that. Yeah. The loft too. Yeah. I think it's going to hurt him. Yeah. That's a yeah, low, yeah low maybe strike. pull it across it a little bit much. Yeah. We got an odd one here to try. Close, Mikey boy. Yeah. Speed and launch are perfect. Feel different? Yeah, yeah. I don't know what yet, but it definitely feels different. Carry just jumped 12. 12 yards, that was good. Path's better, right? Mm -hmm. Was that launch? Uh, 12, 12 and a half, yeah. 2,500? I'm okay with that. Yeah, totally. I'm totally. okay with that. That's still got a chance, doesn't yeah. it? That's when it hits the ground. Yeah, That's I think that has to. Yeah. So now you're up on it, one and a half. Yeah. Really good. How long was that auto flex you were playing? 46? 46. Yeah. It wasn't bad for the start, but then after a while it just too long and yeah. You think it was too long or you think it was too light and too soft and combination Bit of, of both? everything? Yeah. Bit of everything. And pink? And no, he, he <laughs> Oh, well, he, got, he got the other one? He called in a favor yeah, and ended yeah, up yeah. with a red and blue one and it's nice I, to be Mike Chris, you know? Yeah, I guess. Uh, the nice thing is those two flew within two yards of each other, yeah. right? So no variance there. Ball speed was within a yeah. 0.4 of each other. Yeah. Super horizontal. And this has SFW too, which for him, like just that weight up top. Right. I'm fine with that. I think the worst. One thing I think Mikey loves to see because always like the minute I think you feel like you don't feel like you can maximize your total distance. Like you want to see land angle on the flatter side. Yeah. You want to see more as you know, on the high end of chase. Yeah. You know something counter. Yeah, man. That's 146. Just immediately spikes back up. Interesting. <laughs> It's just more solid, yeah, right? Yeah. I like this one. I like. I think that. I like the easier. It's e it is easier to turn over, yeah. which yeah. is nice. That's just because that balance point's up top, right? Yeah, it sits good. Yeah, two seventy on that one, Mikey. Thirty-two land. I mean, oh, and, I like it. Yeah, you'll you'll. I mean, you carry that a little bit more if that falls onto the, the yeah. target line, just because you'll retain a bit more. And is it as that angle attack? gets worked on, yeah. this yeah. is just yeah. gonna be even better. Yeah. And honestly, this length has helped out a little bit too, yeah. right? I don't think you noticed, but this is longer. Oh, okay. So this is 45 and a half, and you know, as the club gets shorter, I feel yeah. like it's your tendency is to go down yeah. and to the left, right? No, I think this feels, this feels great. I like it. I love the shape of it. I'm happy. A2, eight degree? Yeah. This is your last chance about the shaft though. Yeah, no, it's nice. <laughs> it is nice. Do you want to try white in it one more time? No, no, this is good. You like no, it? let's good. try it. No, I'd rather try it. I want to, okay, because if, if we don't, right? Doesn't matter, weight looks the same. Just shitey. If we don't try it, you're going to go home and put it in. And I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly why I said it. I know exactly what he's going to do. And then it's still, you know, the split MOI, I don't know how much JJ went into that, but it's, that's really huge for us this year, right? Mm -hmm. You know, we had to change the shape for Steve Ogg, right? He really wanted a really fast driver. Yes. But to do that, we had to change the material of the top. I don't know if JJ told you, right? It's a thermocarbon on top, right. right? Because of that, we saved so much weight. And then Stephanie and her team were able to go in there and do split MOI. So there's weight forward, yeah. which is really fast, yeah. right? But there's also weight back. Yeah. So you get fast plus stability. Mm. Right, and I think so, that's that's kind of the game changer. Why we will see more twos on tour. Right, right. Get a nice hot CT one. Forty one. At the uh, forty five uh, inches. Yeah. Maybe because you said it, and I'm a head case, but it definitely it feels short now. Yeah, okay. it feels short. I mean, you went right back to hitting down on it. Yeah. 
Right. That's so look, there's you're losing quite a bit of ball speed when you hit down. Yeah. What was that one? Yeah. Down again? I think no, it was one two up, up, but yeah. you're I think that blue honestly that is great for you. Good, yeah. I like it. I've always liked it. Is the that blue. fifty stiff as well? Yeah. Yeah. This is exactly we built this just because we knew this is he was in this. Yeah. You want to put the blue back in? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Was the sound you made the first time you hit it? Uh, I, don't no. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> yeah. To be honest, three was four six. Yeah, four six immediately. Just it's pretty good. Slip four miles an hour just with that. That's just for the shaft. Yeah. Right? The with uh, the three woods, they're going to be the one I'm I'm super interested to see. You probably have always hated three woods. Really? I hope I do it justice. Down I know. I know. So you like you have some success with it. Just I hope I do it justice. It hit mine like how I normally play. Yeah. Yeah. True. Yeah. Oh. 148. Okay, we're done. It's the best. Blue, baby. Blue. The best. I love Dead Sea Blue. <laughs> it's just the balance point. It's just that SFW, right? If you're gonna play light, I wanna get some weight up top. Yeah. And that one's still a bit steep, but it's definitely, I like it. I think GT2. exactly like you said, Chris, that north-south with this is yeah. unbelievable. So yeah. You just don't fall off. It sits great, that's most important. Yeah. And that heel strike isn't as spinny as TSR. TSR, yeah. that heel strike got a little spinny, right? Love it, nice excited, work. thank you. Okay. If I see you in a year, six months, I don't care what <laughs> color it is, but just make sure this is the same shot. Uh, All right, let's see the three-wood. I think it's just where you're finding your swing right now as well. Like like Chris said, like, huh, I, I thought you would have been really good with the three-wood, yeah. and you are really good right yeah. now with the... Yeah, I think it's more historically he's he yeah. he kind of had a bit of a block on it until he until he yeah, found I didn't that play one. I didn't play three wood for the longest no. time. I played XR yeah. four wood basically. Yeah. That's all I had. And then I just uh, a fraction of a fan. I don't remember what the length that is. That might be forty three, but I am a fraction of a fan of like a little shorter fan. It is forty three. I measured it when you got in. Yeah. Um, five wood's a bit short. Yeah, five wood was forty one and a half. Yeah. Um, I did put it out towards the toe though. Okay. Because oddly enough, like he hits the driver off the heel, but mm -hmm. this one, and look yeah. at that where it's towards it's the toe. Side, yeah. Yeah. Nice and quick with this. This thing sounds great. Yeah, 145 ball there, 228 two, carry. 228 carry, 243 total. Still at 42 land, yeah. so into that green, it's good. Yeah. Beauty. I just love how high they Beauty. launch now. You know, like it's something mm -hmm. that I just. I think it is well. What's nice about this, you're going to get over. I think a bit of a mental hurdle that it's that it's that three wood that's got you over the hill in terms of liking three wood. It's yeah, not totally. You're actually swinging really nicely to hit a three wood well now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Opens opens the box of options. It actually spins less too than yours. Like, Interesting. Considerably, like it's not just like a little bit. Like you know, yours is 43 and 41. And that's what 13 launch. Yeah, 13 and 37. I mean, the first one you hit, I think it was a little bit of a miss at 45, but that's 3,036 in the last two. It's carrying 222, but best it's carrying 226, 227. Um, still at that same window. If anything, I would say it's a touch higher. Yeah. It's at 95 feet. Land angle's improved. Would you be te tempted to try GT2? Oh, of course, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we want you to hit everything. Okay. <laughs> and with your height, I wouldn't even, like, 13 and a half is going to be an option too, Definitely, right? With yeah. that, because 13 and a half now, I think, is with the size of two plus, right? right? I love that head. Is that what you got fit into? Yeah. yeah that's good. Yeah. I, I hit the GT3 good too, but I, I just that head shape of GT2 yeah. just looks amazing. Thank you. Oh. Wow. Jeez. Oh that was God. insane. Put your driver away. 146. Yeah, we're done. That's nice. Oh, 94 <laughs> feet. Take one of those. Those are nice. Ryan Anders, wow. if you're watching. Hey, at least it's a at least it's a 1K blue, right? <laughs> <laughs> that thing felt great. Uh, yeah. 233 to 250, 3500 spin, 12 launch. As good as I've ever seen yet at 3 Yeah. 
40, almost 41 land too. So even at that lower loft, right? Yeah, still got a chance. I do see two launching a little touch higher than the three. So mm -hmm. he kind of supports that lower loft a little bit better. Yeah. For him. Money. Money, money. 4-4 four, four ball, 13 launch. This thing's nice. I like this over the three. So it you is, like it over the three? Yeah, because that being a 15, I like something that's a like 230-ish carry with it because I do use it as a tee club. Yeah. So if it runs and it... Yeah. But if you think about it though, that's, yeah, 15, but actually four playing Correct. 14... Two five. Oh, yeah. You've got thirteen five with CG back, a little bit of a bigger profile. So the projected CG on this one is probably not that different, but you're getting the benefit of having less oh, static loft yeah. for the ball speed. Good point. Yeah. So you're getting wins. Okay. I so did, easy, dude. Yeah. The thirteen and a half makes that one better. It's crazy how how high it goes. Yeah, right. Just the win on ball speed. It's just like mentally for quick. the thir thirteen and a half. Like a couple of years ago, I would say. Yeah, no, no. I know. we were here for TSR. Yeah. yeah. Ryan Andrews got me a two plus, and I yeah. when he I took it out of the box, I just said, "Here, give it to someone that can use it, because yeah. I can't get this thing off the ground. For right. sure. I kill worms with it." <laughs> but well, yeah, just, this this you, thing's money. That wipe miss is is at the spin of your good stealth. Yeah. Totally. Right? Totally. No, I love this. And club. what saves in there is just the law. Definitely. Like you're other than other than one that you lost a little bit, right? Your apex control has been unbelievable yeah. as well. Like 92, 94. Yeah, a couple. Like, spun out of them but yeah. the, when you turn on them like they yeah. they're flat yeah. flatter for me which is nice but yeah i like this yeah, nice window right there, yeah for sure um, nice work all right well now that we have a th you got three wood that goes a number yeah. i noticed you have a five wood in you i don't yeah i'm not that comfortable i know you quite like the five wood you've got but i, I think this could be better i think it's spinny but yeah it was good and then we were testing something indoors and he decided to change the setting and don't like it anymore okay <laughs> <laughs> he, just, Live like, he just put all ownership on you no he was the fitter <laughs> That sounds like our relationship in a nutshell there, Chris. Right. I was going along quite nicely, but then Ian done this and then it all went. <laughs> that basically sums it up. <laughs> I'm curious to see how close this goes to his stealth three wood. You know what I mean? Yeah, so this this replaced, he had uh, seven wood in the bag for a little well, while. That was a mistake. Don't talk about those days. What, how long is this, 41 and a half? 41 and a half, yeah. Yeah. So it's a little shorty. That's the one I'd, I'd... I know. That's what that seven would did too. Yeah. You get that high, cutty... Like, spinning. if you need to play anything into the wind, Done. You're, you're losing yeah. nine miles an hour ball speed. Totally. There and, versus, that, and that only carries 88. Yeah. Right? There, yeah, there's a... Is that a dump? Is that a mystery don't spin, or do you think actually that's if you catch is a low heel one, it no, probably could go that high? I think so, too. Yeah, it sure looked like it was yeah. high. I thought I'll it would see be that high. Fizzy. If it was I'll double, I think it would be like, say, nine yeah. or ten. Yeah. There you go. More of the ball speed you want, Mikey, but yeah, just it does it does kick up and yeah, yeah. spin for okay. sure. Those last three, four swings have been junk. Junk. Hey, we're done. Mikey. I was going to say, like, I know you hated the last one, but it was one three nine ball. Yeah. You flush that one, one, three, nine ball. Yeah. So five miles an hour less than your three would, it's really good. Yeah. Yeah, if this, honestly, if this club could be like a, for me, like 220, that's, that's what I'd want. That's what it is. If there's a couple of holes at the club that, into the wind, you'd, it yeah. demands yeah. something that, what was Do the spin? Do you have the 16.5 head? Yeah. I wouldn't mind seeing you hit the 16.5 head at 41 and a half, just to see if, because at 102 on a really flush one, I don't feel like it leaves you that much wiggle room if you miss it and kick the spin up because that was 39.50. You could still miss one at 5,000 here. Mm, yeah. Whereas yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. you've got a little less loft. But the shaft being tipped, right? right? Yeah. You see yeah. It now yeah. it's not 6,000, mm -hmm. right? And then I think three to two helps. Yep. I love that flight there though. I yeah, just think 16.5, nice. let's hit it. It's just going to be too close to the... It'd be Three close. Ones. I mean, I just wonder if there's a, like a on the whether it's like D3 or yeah. something like that. So yeah, upright yeah, yeah, and up yeah, yeah, at 17.25. Yeah, yeah. I love the head shape, just the, the little fraction of an increase in head shape. With, so nice. That looks great. Actually, it looks a fraction. It sits very square. Yeah. I'll give it that. Oh 
Maybe I hear too hot. Yeah. What's the speed? 143. Yeah. Three with territory. This is 16.5 at 17. Bad. Close. But the three was a 2.30. I know. Yeah. Right? Yeah, two. Well, you said you wanted what? 2.20, but I think that's... So, do you, I mean, do you really need 2.20? I know, I know that's what you want, but like four iron-wise, what are you going to carry four iron? 205? Yeah, max. So, if you're yeah. 217, which is where the five wood was, really that's good. actually right where you want it. So this, this is at sea level, too, so... Yeah. I think everything adjusts a little bit. But that but. spins exactly the same as where the last good five yeah. wood was. Yeah. Mm, I'm just curious to see what this one does. Play was nice. Wow, this is close. It's man. really good. I just yeah. think I think this this is gonna hurt you from like what do you do from two fifteen now? Yep. yep. What do you do from two seventeen? Hit and pray. <laughs> hit four iron. Hit one with that. Oh, just to, yeah, just that'd be to good see. to see. Come on. It's close. It's really close. I mean, you're honestly like, you're like, you're just somewhere right between the two is. This is gonna go 170 now. This means you need a five wood. <laughs> what do you think? Maybe go five wood and go back to 42 rather than 41 and a half. Just gain a little bit of speed. Yeah, I'm gonna go C3 here. That first. might be interesting. I'm gonna go here. I think this will help. Yeah. We'll okay. Spin, right. Yeah. You flush that? Yeah. yeah. 200, perfect, perfect. You say go a little longer? Just wonder, just like it. 42 and a quarter? No, no, but that, that's, that's a decent size jump, but I don't know, let's see what this does. And I think that's so the even. one that gets a little better. We didn't, yeah. he didn't hit that one with the 18, yeah. but. I think he could. I know, he definitely, definitely, it's in the locker. Yeah. Still gives you 210. I think if you do that with the 18, yeah, I know you didn't, we only hit two with yeah, it, but yeah. I think that's the one we're scared of, is like, when you do that, it's gonna go 200. I think a cab at Citrus Farms, wow. about 14 in that par five, where it's blown back in and you hit your seven wood, and you must have hit 150 yards. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, it's true, because I don't have yeah. a, a ferry wood that, Yeah. I mean, I should just hit three wood, really. Yeah. I should hit driver off the deck at that point. But yeah, um, yeah, I don't. The five wood never is great in three yeah. wood. And you know, this we had some fun with the length here, yeah. right? To make this one not go so far. Uh -huh. But I think it fits better for your miss. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think good to good, they're really close. I know I do as well. Yeah, but go eighteen or go sixteen. No, it's no. I think so. This is sixteen five. Seventeen. Two, eighteen. Five. It's it's the shot you just hit. Yeah. That I don't like. Yeah. Because it's going to spin it close to fifty five hundred. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. going to go two hundred. Yeah. This protects the miss. Yeah. Yes. And, and as time goes on and you get more comfortable with where that swing direction gets a little bit more neutral, slightly more right, where yeah. you'll yeah. have an easier time turning four four iron yeah. to to totally. give, you yeah. know give yourself a little extra out of that. Cool. I love it. Yeah, I think that's amazing. So forty one half. That's a plus four in there. Right, just to balance it a yeah. little bit. Okay, sure. And um, tip properly. And tip, tip properly. properly, yeah. Built properly. So it's actually it's it's that's five wood tipping. So okay. it's it's inch and yeah. a half. Into a you know, sixteen and a half would be an inch, but I actually like it an inch and a half because your yeah. spin. And that's a TB ADS. That. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, I it's like perfect. it. Perfect. I like it. No, these woods are impressive. I love them. Yeah. You know, we're excited for the driver, but like I'm really excited for the fairway woods. Yeah. I feel like it's the biggest change we made. A three wood was. Yeah. I didn't think anything could touch old yeah. stealthy, but. And that's the one, you know, of doing fittings over the last couple of years when someone had that one in, it yeah. was like, eh, you know, yeah, like yeah, I, gotta, yeah. I, gotta, I gotta hope he doesn't like it because oh, it's yeah. pretty good, right? Totally. But now I feel like there's there's, there's no holes, right? It's really it. good. I love Very it. cool. Awesome. Amazing. Thank boys. you, sir. Yeah, so when I see you, Tensi no Tensi Blue. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir, Thanks, I appreciate it. Thanks, Ian. Thanks, buddy. It's nice to fit with you every day. No, it's nice to have a partner in crime. That's what I love it. All right, Chris, great work. You put Mikey through his paces there. That was, uh, there was a bit of work to do. Yeah. A bit of work to do from the gamer you brought in, TSR3. 10 to eight, no uh -huh. longer. When we could have said it yesterday, oh, it'll be tough to, tough to beat this one. Yeah, yeah. And, and we went actually in a quite a different direction with yeah. this year's drivers. Totally. Yeah, pretty excited. I mean, I think the goal was to make you better. I think we did that. Thank I you. Think, you know, GT2, deeper CG for him, really helped his start direction. Yeah. Right, and he just was way more consistent on ball speed across the face. That heel miss plagued you, totally. and it's something we've heard with totally. TSR. 
and you know the heel miss was a little slow, a little spinny, and now we just saw really consistent ball speeds and spin across the whole face. Yeah, the miss is a little bit more controlled, which is nice, and especially on the, I mean, the three wood is mm -hmm. has beat old faithful. That's right. Yeah. Well done, job yeah. done. Uh, the five wood now to protect away from that, you know, six thousand spin yep. miss is. Yep. These things are impressive, really, really nice. Yeah. What I loved about what Chris done with the driver was he put you in something that's going to help the direction you're trying to move with the improvement of your swing. Totally. You're not going to fight that face-to-path relationship nearly as much having the CG back where you get a faster rate of closure. You're going to start to, I think, aim a little bit better because mm -hmm. you have a tighter start-to-fall line. 100%. Like you're going to be a much, much more neutral, which is scary for me. You're going to be a more neutral driver of the golf ball. I was Good. kind of hoping things might go a little sideways today. <laughs> nope. Nope. I paid Chris under uh, the so table. It's not really helping my cause here, Chris, but I'm somewhat happy for Mike. Love it. Very cool. Fairways, talk about those a little bit. Yeah, three wood. Um, 13 Would you five. ever thought you saw the day? Not in a Titleist 13 5 fairway wood. You're seeing a lot of that, Chris. Yeah, because it's, it's so much easier to launch, yeah. right? Yeah. And, you know, for him, the 15 was really good too, right? Yeah. The GT315, we yeah. kind of started there and we yeah. thought we found it. And I said, let's try the two. Mm -hmm. Maintain launch as the 315, but the spin came down, yeah. ball yeah. speed went up. You know, again, you miss, you fight it driver, you fight it three wood. It's that spinny kind of fallback totally. one. So I think as you guys know, you know, fitting players isn't always about making good shots better. Right. I think that's really hard to do sometimes. And yeah. his good shots were good. It's about making those bad shots closer to his good shot. Yeah. yeah. Right. Five wood was uh was interesting. Six that sixteen was fun. five yeah. um versus the eighteen. And mm -hmm. again that you know, there's a couple holes at my club that if it is into the wind, it yeah, mm -hmm. it's six thousand spinning goes nowhere. This this fights it and yeah, the launch out of this thing was wicked. But giving you the versatility from the sure fit sleeve yep. that totally. you can get to play with lie angle and loft a little bit. Yeah. So you actually end up in 17 to 5. Mm -hmm. So it just helps you a little bit on that miss, just tightens that that sort of that sort of brings the seal uh, the floor up a little bit on totally. that miss where you, we saw you spin with your old one, couple at six thousand. Yeah. You know, it just protects you so much. I think that last one you kinda of missed it a little bit, spun it at five, which is you can get away with that yeah, one. Yeah. I I didn't think you guys could improve the woods year after year, but the GTs are they're impressive. They're really good. Yeah, I'm excited. Really, really really good. The next two years are going to be fun. Yeah, right? yeah, totally. It's always fun when we have something really cool coming out. Well, guys, I mean, what a treat it is to come out here and get the tour treatment, get the, the full experience, uh, have the ability for the guys, not only to let us try the heads, but you were prepared with some shafts and coming out with some shafts, maybe that you haven't tried in the, pla the past. You mm -hmm. were playing 10, say 1K uh, white, white yeah. and, and now you're in blue with a little higher balance point. Again, just balancing out the whole build a little bit more for, for your benefit. All those little incremental marginal gains totally. that just make a massive, massive difference. So you know, we, we know and we're going to hear a lot about what's in the head and the new construction. But I think what Chris is incredible at doing is unlocking the potential of this with the whole the whole 100%. part. Yeah, yeah. the shaft was, uh, was a not a massive change, but a better change. Yeah, yeah. D don't change better. it. I won't change it, I promise. <laughs> much, much better. All right, guys, uh, what a treat it is to be down here at TPI. I hope you guys enjoy the videos. Um, you know, I enjoyed my time with JJ. It was amazing it's to go awesome. through the full process as well. So uh, let us know below if uh, by the time you've you've seen this video, which is going to be obviously after embargo, if you've had a chance to try the GT line, I'd love to hear your thoughts. We've been blown away today by the gains that we've seen. Love to hear your thoughts on that as well. Huge thanks to everyone at Titles for having us down here. What a massive treat. It was really, really a Thanks, pleasure. Chris. Thanks for coming. Anytime. Yeah. Awesome. Guys, stay tuned for more. We'll see you again soon.